Two fires threaten several communities. Liz is live tonight in Lakeport, and Liz, you saw the firefight up close and personal. Yeah, that's right, Chris. We're in downtown Lakeport right, right now, which as you can see is uh, completely empty. It's under a mandatory evacuation order and so far has been untouched by the river fire. That's the southern fire that's part of the Mendocino complex. But just minutes away from here tonight, there was a dramatic shift in the winds that pushed those fire flames toward this town. It ended up touching just a little bit northwest of here in an area with structures and homes. And as you said, we were on the front lines of that fire. We're going to show you these dramatic pictures. At one point, uh, we're told there were flames up 200 feet in the air, and we did see several structures burning, outhouses, barns. At this point, we can't say if any or how many homes in that area were destroyed. This was, we know if you're familiar with the area on Hendricks Road and Scotts Valley Road. Uh, we also know just up the road on Desi Drive structures were burned. But we were there as these firefighters worked tirelessly to build protection lines around those homes, doing everything they could to save them. And during a Facebook Live from there, I did ask a fire official, should people in Lakeport continue to be worried about this? You know, what's next here? And this is what he said. Well, this is the exact reason why that was evacuated for this this reason. You know, it looked pretty benign earlier today. Um, we had the increase in winds, as you can see. There's dark plumes of smoke coming from um, further down on Hendricks and Scotts Valley Road. Uh, that's actually Scotts Valley Road. Um, so, yeah, definitely uh, a concern of ours and why we had this area evacuated. Yeah, and as he said, the winds continue to be erratic and unpredictable, and so it's really unclear when people will be allowed to come back into this area around Lakeport. But even so, I mean, it's just gotten smokier even over the past 24 hours. I want to show you two pictures that our photojournalist Randy Garcia took, one from yesterday evening around 8 p.m. here that we're showing you from here in Lakeport. This is a picture of the lake. You can see it's a little bit smoky there. Now we're going to show you this picture from tonight 8 p.m. here in Lakeport. If you can see, I mean, you really can't even see the lake at all. It is just so smoky here. And so, you know, as far as numbers right now, uh, the Mendocino Complex fire as a whole is burning about 80,000 acres right now. It's about 12% contained. We do not know the cause of these fires at this point. It's still under an investigation. And Cal Fire still says that just seven structures have burned from this fire. But of course, Chris, we saw with our own eyes that that number will go up.